Welcome back to another Project X Top Step X tutorial video. This is going to be a short video showing exactly how to take the Project X browser platform and turn it into a app for your computer and also an app for your mobile phone. Okay. So if you are using Google Chrome, make sure you are logged in Project X here. Make sure that the password is also saved in the platform. Okay. And all you need to do is click the three dots at the top right corner here. Go all the way down to save and share okay cast save and share and click install top one features okay so if we click on this click install as you can see it just opened up a new app for us okay let me just zoom in for you guys here this is a completely separate app compared to google chrome okay this is its own thing here there's no tabs it is just project x and at the same time, it should have also added an app on your desktop looking something like this right here. Okay, so as you can see, it is a top one features app that if you just exit out of this, double click, it should open up the app exactly how you last had it. Okay, fairly quickly. Let's jump into the iPhone so you can see how it's done there as well, okay? So this is how it's done on the mobile platform, specifically on an iPhone. First, open up Safari. As you can see, I am on Safari right now. I have gone to topointfutures.projectx.com. Same thing as on the browser. Make sure that you are uh, logged in and also the password is saved. So if I click on the username here, as you can see, it says the password for my email address is already saved. So make sure that has already happened, okay? Sign in. And then once you are signed in, you want to click this middle icon that we have here in the middle that looks like a share. Okay. And then scroll, scroll, and then click add to home screen. Put the name that you want to have there, top one futures. I personally like it as TOF. Click add. And as you can see here, it just got added into our home screen, right? So you don't have to go to the browser, log in again, do all those steps. It's already an app on your iPhone. So if I click on this, we are logged in into the platform just like so. Okay.